We wanted to accomplish a more open door kind of policy here at the school. We wanted to open up communication with all of the parents, more parent involvement, more community involvement, more partnership involvement. There's five big communities that surround this school and uh, slowly we've been bringing each of them in. Um, even our principal has gone to some of the home association meetings just to, to really build a bond between the communities again with our school. I think the students are doing extremely well because they're seeing their community in the schoolhouse. We always talk about it takes a, a village to raise a child. Well, with community volunteers, it's that village and it's bringing everyone together to help with our ultimate goal and that's ensuring that our students are successful. I feel like I'm more than a parent here. When I walk in, I'm like, okay, who needs help? Where am I going? Is it the guidance counselor today? Is it the cafeteria today? And if I can't be there, I make sure I have a, a nice tree list <laughs> of different parents and volunteers that we can count on to come in to help the school. That's, that's a daily thing for me. I make sure the school has the help when they need it. She makes my job so much easier because I'll go to her, Ms. Johnson, hey, I need this, I need that. No problem. She doesn't say, well, I can't, I can't. She says, when do you need it? How many people do you need? I'm gonna make it happen. And when the time comes, everything is in place. She's here every day. And not because her children are here, but because she wants to be here. Because most of the time when she's here, she's not even dealing with her child. I do have a full-time job. I go to school. I have a son in a different school that I volunteer at. I was in Girl Scouts for a while, but you know, you do, you have to take some stuff on your pla off your plate and, and put stuff back on your plate and this is something I will always have on my plate because I live four doors down and this is one of the reasons I bought my house down there is because of this beautiful school that deserves beautiful people and that's, that's what I'm here to find and be.